Hey guys, welcome back to another video with InfoSec Pat. In this video, we're going to be going over day number eight for the advent of Cyber 2022 from TriHackMe. So we're going to continue with the story on day number eight. And if you are new to the channel, please subscribe, share, and all that good stuff. If you're returning, welcome back and let's, let's get cracking. So before we actually get started, I want to be the first to say, like I did read through it. I did some preliminary stuff. I downloaded the files and I want to show you guys how to do that. I just wanted to get some familiarity with this before. But so, as soon as I read, you know, what is blockchain and Ethereum and uh, all that good stuff, that's not my strong point. I'm going to be honest. So this is going to be a challenge for me. And if it is for you, let's <laughs> let's have fun together because I'm actually a little worried. I'm going to be honest, like this might take me a while to understand and, and, and get through this, but we're going to get through it. So I already read through everything. Uh, I want to you know, go you know, down a little bit and get to, the, get to the practical application. So I downloaded the files you know, up here, all the way up. You click here to download the files. I downloaded the file. I extracted the files to a folder called day eight. And if we do an LS, we have the two files here. So all you have to do is download it, open it up, extract it to a location. So you have the two files here, because I'm sure we're going to need this to upload in some time. I'm not sure when and how and whatnot, but I'm sure we're going to need those files because that's that's the reason why they provided them. So let's continue here. Let's go to the practical application. <coughs> Excuse me. So practical application, we covered all the you know all of the background information, blah blah blah. So what we're going to do is go ahead and open up Remix that uh, Remix IDE. Let's open up in a new window. See what's uh, what's cracking with this. Okay, all right. So I see a new file, open file. Okay, cool deal. So let's go ahead and go back. Download the zip file attached to the task and open uh, Remix with your preferred browser. So we have provided you two files, one generated by the Best Festival Company used for the you know hosting their cryptocurrency balance, and another malicious contract that will that will uh, attempt to exploit their uh, recurring vulnerabilities. So I'm going to be, like I said, I'm not too, too familiar with crypto. I'm not too familiar with contracts. So this is going to be, <laughs> this is going to be a fun ride. Um, so let's go ahead and import the necessary contracts. So it says go in here. So go to navigate file explorer, default workspace, load a local file. And then we're going to go ahead and select the necessary dot sole files be imported. So we provided you with a ether store.sol and an attack.sol files that uh, functions as we introduced uh, in the section. So that's task one. So let's go ahead and get that first before we jump in. Let's make this a little bigger. See if I can a larger. All right. So this is the workspace upload uh, day eight. Yes, we're going to choose these two open. Okay, we have our two files here now. All right, now this is getting scary because this is above my pay grade, folks. No, I'm just kidding. Semi. Um, so we can compile the contracts. So the next step is to compile the contracts. So let's go ahead and drop down and compile. Okay, so let's go ahead and give that a go. So let's go back, see if we can figure this out. So we, on the side here, simply uh, Compiler. So what is it? Uh, 0.8.10 plus uh, 0.8.10. I believe it's that one. FC. Yep, that looks right. Okay, cool. So, so then we have compile. So I guess what we have to do is we have to click on. So if I if I click on, for example, EtherSoul, and I go to compile, it's gonna Select EtherSoul, uh, EtherStore, sorry, EtherSoul. All right, so let's go ahead and go to the attack first, and let's go ahead and compile this. Hope you guys don't laugh at me struggling through this. 
I can only imagine what I'm going to be getting in the comments for this one. Dude, do you even know what you're doing? Absolutely not. But that's the whole point of this, right? Not knowing what we're doing when we enter and know what we're doing when we leave. All right, so that's the first one. I'm not sure if we have to compile both of them. All right, so let's go ahead and so deploying the contracts. So once we do that, we have to deploy it. So London, does it show an account that we have to do anything with the account? All right, so let's go back. Whoops. So let's see here. Now I'm getting a little, a little nervous. All right, so let's go ahead and say, for example, contract. We're going to do a contract. We're going to do EtherSoul, right? And then we're going to deploy it. And we have this deployed right down here. Perfect. We're on a so deployed. Let's let's. Is there a way to move this up? Okay. So we have. We have the deploy contracts here on the left hand side here. So Ether balance is zero. So it looks like it all all took place. So let's go ahead and go back. All right, so all right, so pretty much I think we're good. So now that uh, now uh, now successfully deployed our first contract and used it, you should see a balance. Okay, so I'm guessing we have to put a balance. Okay, so let's go ahead and in the value. We can put, for example, 10. I don't know. And we're going to put Ether. And then deposit down here. Bada bing. We got 10 of those bad boys. I don't know what that means, but we got 10. But we hope we hit the lotto or something. I'm just kidding. All right. So now the contract. So pretty much that was it. So now we deploy the contract by pressing to deploy and then confirm the contract that. All right, so pretty much what we have to do is the same thing for the attack. So I think that's it. Yeah, so that's what we probably have to do. So let's go ahead and go to the attack. This is the bad boy, right? So it looks like we have to take the, say, execute, blah, blah, the value input, execute. So pretty much what we have to do is copy, uh, copy this here. And then we can put this in the, the address, paste this, the paste. OK. And for example, let's put a value, I don't know, 2. And then, wait. First, we have to deploy the attack. All right, I think I messed up here. Let's. Uh, Let's go ahead and put this back to zero because I, I don't think I deployed back yet. Uh, am I doing something wrong? All right, so let's put a value in one, deploy. Error, okay. Let's go back. This is what I mean. I knew I was going to get stumped somehow, you know? So, so this is the Ether contract. I think there's something. We have to deploy this. Let me see if I. Somehow we have to deploy the attack. Ether. See if I hit zero here. Boy. Error. Press. See if I copy this address. Boy. Okay. All right. Here we go. We're cooking. We're cooking. All right. So now. We have attack. All right, cool. Now we have the contract deployed for attack. All right, cool. So let's go back now. 
And if you get stuck, we read, yep, this is what I got stuck. All right, execute the execute or interact with the contracts function. Note that most contracts are input, the function blah, blah, blah. All right, so now what we have to do is we can put like, for example, one here, and then we can hit attack. And hopefully something happens. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I hope I know what I'm doing. I don't know. I'm supposed to do something. It says pending. Uh, let's see. Let's give it a second, I guess. Uh oh. Oh, boom. We did it, folks. We got a flag. Damn. This is probably the hardest one. And if it gets harder than this, guys, I'm in trouble. Yes, we did it. There we go. Day number eight is complete. And let me look over how many minutes? 10 minutes. Wow. I thought it was going to be a lot longer than this. And this was the hardest one for me. Um, I learned a lot because obviously I did some preliminary reading prior to you know jumping on the video because I don't want this to be a reading session. But this was fun. This was a learning experience. I'm probably going to do this one more time offline just so I get the, the gist of this. But this is pretty cool. But I really appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, and all that. And until day nine, have a good one, folks.